So this is a older toy Tonka truck and trailer that I wanted to show you today. Um, it's from 1995, and it's got a really cool hidden feature that I'll show you in, in, later in the video. But it squeaks as <coughs> expected because of older toys, they squeak. But the cool thing is that the back gates of the trailer can be opened. And I thought this had a ramp, but I guess not. And then I got, I so you got a stream of lights across the bottom and the other side. It's Owens and Miner, that's a drug company, I believe. Front lights light up. I've tested it and it does work. There's a hidden feature, so let me show you something. So we take the trailer off. Hang on, I gotta, I gotta take the trailer off. And then you play the sound on the truck. These lights and these lights come on. And then you're like, okay, how does the trailer get lights? And then you're like, oh, there's the battery cover. And then when you unscrew it, you unscrew the battery cover of the trailer. You're like, okay, the batteries are probably just inside. <laughs> but you're like, where are the metal pieces that connect the batteries? And you're like, so how does this thing light up? And then here is where it gets interesting. Here's where it gets real interesting. This is how it gets the lights. It doesn't need batteries. It's kind of like a plug. When you plug the uh, trailer hitch into the truck fifth wheel, you're you're making a you're you're making a connection. You're making a full circuit. So it's kind of like plugging this into an outlet. So when you plug the fifth when you plug the hitch into the fifth wheel, you're plugging the lights in, and that's how the trailer makes lights. I think the back, yeah, it's got lights on the back. Well, I don't know if those work, though. They light up a little bit, though. Same with the other side. So, yeah, that is actually really clever. I had no idea that's how it worked until now. So, it's a really nice truck. Um... It has the same sound on two buttons. It has four buttons. Press the bottom one, you get this. Press the top button, you get this. So these two buttons must be tied to the same circuit. Which is okay. That means you just get three sounds. And then you get the horn, which sounds more like a... Uh, uh, an emergency siren. But at least you do get sounds with this, which is very nice. Probably like toys around the mid-90s is when they started coming out with sounds. I think even the early 80s, too. So. Yeah, this is actually a very nice toy, and I want to keep it for as long as I can.